Howdy, folks. Our dear neighbor told us about their chuck box that she found up in the attic that they used to use car camping with the kids many years ago. And I really didn't know what a chuck box was, so I looked it up online. And uh, they were really cool. They had all sorts of different designs and everything. Uh, the thing is, it's just my wife and I that, that camp together. So we don't really need an exotic or large outdoor kitchen. But uh, it would be nice to have something to carry some of our car camping stuff. We uh, do some backpacking and we also travel in our vehicle. But when we do car camp, there's certain things that we like to have, like our Dutch oven or maybe a, uh, a cast iron skillet, maybe our oil lantern, kind of stuff like that that's, that's just kind of related to car camping. So we came up with this. It's basically a, a wooden box that is about a foot wide and about two feet long. And uh, just here on the ground, I guess you could use it as a, as a bench or you could use it as a uh, kind of a coffee table between two, two chairs. But we do have legs for it. I actually salvaged these aluminum legs off of a stool and I actually shortened them so they're the appropriate height. And they're one inch aluminum and they fit right into some uh, blocks in the bottom of the, uh, the chest here. And that brings it up to a height that's a little bit better to work with or work on if you're preparing something or you want a higher table or something to, to get the lantern up a little bit higher. Uh, if you look at the back, I'm going to flip it around. There's actually a support here for the lid and it's hinged and it comes out to support the lid when it's open. So basically uh, you can open the lid and uh, just drop it down. You don't have to worry about it, uh, you know, having enough support to set things on there. Uh, inside, it's actually large enough for a 10-inch cast iron uh, Dutch oven. In fact, there's room for two of them. You can put, put them side by side, and you might even be able to stack some uh, other items there, there too. And in the center, there's some grooves for a divider. And this happens to be just a short divider, which is enough to keep the Dutch oven from moving around. Yet uh, you can still put long uh, items into the box uh, full length that may be larger than, than that. Uh, in the front, I have a, a hinged door. And inside here is actually a uh, drawer. And uh, same thing with the drawer. I put some grooves in the drawer. And actually, I put uh, a, a large number of sets of them. So you can put dividers in and uh, organize it any way that you want. Uh, you can actually keep the drawer out if you want to have it open while you're working. Uh, you can close the lid, work right here, or, or you know, still have access to the inside and set things on the top. Or you can also take the drawer out actually set it uh, inside inside the top with some stops and uh, use it that way if you want but uh, you usually don't. Uh, also what I like to do is I put a, a trash bag on the, the one side and uh, Let's see here. I tie a dish towel on the other side. Put this handy. And the only other thing I might like to add is a coat hanger uh, wire hook to go through here to hold some paper towels that I can just hook on the outside here. Would be good to go. So that's about it. Uh, there's a, a lot of different things that you could do differently. You can make maybe two separate drawers. You can get rid of the drawer altogether and maybe make this larger and store the Dutch oven directly in the front. 
You can uh, maybe even get rid of this, this section completely and just have a, a tray in the top. Uh, one thing I was thinking of too is instead of having the lid open this way, maybe cutting it in half and having it open the other way. Uh, change the, dimension of the dimensions of the box. You can do all sorts of different things. Uh, go ahead and look online and uh, take a look at what they have listed there uh, so you can actually build a box that's just perfect for you. Uh, thanks for watching and happy car camping!